Pete, you don't have a television, so I'm going to be a special guest on today's... I was going to open this. The city of Baltimore is not going to be the only city in unrest protesting this week. Andrew's pissed. There. there. I've, got, I've got enough anger for an entire city, as a matter of fact. The, Andrew's mad. Today's episode of It's Gotta Go is about television before 7 a.m. I'm talking the basic TV. Not cable, not Netflix, not satellite. I'm talking basic antenna TV before 7 a.m. Have you tried it? Have you have you woken up early and wanted to watch some television? It's pathetic. Do you know what we got on PBS? You got Why Lana Hawaiian Yoga from the 1990s. From the 1990s. I looked it up. Okay. On Fox, you've got infomercials. All right. One time I decided to just sit through an infomercial because they're sometimes entertaining, right? No. This was an infomercial advertising the antenna as a special way to watch television for free. For free television. The, they were selling the antenna as a special way to watch television like Roku or Zulu or whatever. The antenna. K-View has got Jason Valentine, which, no offense, buddy, but, dude, you're almost asleep. I don't know how you're supposed to keep me awake. On KNDU, they got Meredith Boggs, who is okay, nice and rock voted her, one of the hottest women in Tri-Cities. However, she had a baby yesterday. Yesterday, she's been off television for like two weeks. She's going to be off television for another couple of weeks. I don't know what we're going to do without Meredith Boggs, but that's it. That's all you got. Now, you'd assume you'd have like Sesame Street for the kids. They wake up at like 6, 6.30. Every parent knows that. Nope, Sesame Street doesn't start till like 11 a.m. There's literally nothing on television until 7 o'clock in the morning. Thank <laughs> you.